Welcome to Furman Pollen's Pollen Beehive application training video. Furman Pollen is at the forefront of pollen research, blossom thinning, and pollination techniques. Furman Pollen is used to increase crop size where pollination problems are limiting production, such as poor weather, frost damage, weak beehives, floral competition, or limited bloom. The receptivity of most flowers is only 12 to 72 hours after they open. Because pollen is a living material that must be applied to a receptive flower in order to set fruit or nuts, getting pollen to the flower at the right time is critical. By using firm and pollen and utilizing these proven application techniques, you will be sure to maximize your set during pollination season. Let's take a look at some of these techniques. Firm and Pollen's easy inserts are used to apply pollen at the beehive entrance. Putting pollen on at the hive entrance makes use of your bees when there's a lack of compatible pollen in your field. Beehive application is used on larger or isolated acreage because it's impossible to contain bees to specific areas. To begin the application process, mark the most active hives with painter's tape during good bee flight. When bee flight has stopped, either late in the afternoon or early in the day, return to the hives and install the inserts. Be sure the opening is sloped toward the hive and is tied against the hive. We typically recommend one insert on every active hive, with a maximum of two inserts per acre. Easy wood inserts are notched in the middle so they can be split in half to accommodate hives with restrictors. Easy cardboard inserts can be tacked or stapled into place at the hive entrance. They can also be cut down to accommodate hives with restrictors or hives with an uncommon entrance. Remove your pollen from the freezer. Allow the pollen to warm up for about 30 minutes. Then place your pollen into the firm and pollen cool bag for transport. Make sure bee flight is occurring for the application. When applying pollen, place 10 grams evenly across the insert opening as shown here. Be sure not to overfill the insert. It limits bee activity and overloaded bees will stop to clean themselves before flight. If you have modified your inserts, adjust the amount of pollen placed in the insert accordingly. For example, if your insert has been reduced by 50%, place 5 grams instead of 10 grams at a time. Narrower inserts will require more visits to each hive. Pollen is applied at the hive entrance in 10 gram increments. 60 grams equals 6 applications pollen should be applied over multiple days to maximize results. Your first application should occur at 15 to 20 percent bloom. At this time the trees will be quite white and two out of ten blossoms will be open. Do not judge bloom stage by the outside rows. Walk the orchard and check for bloom consistency. Additional applications are determined by how quickly or slowly your bloom progresses and must be spread out over the entire receptive bloom period. The weather will play the largest role in determining the speed at which the blooms move. Weather conditions control your application strategies, so plan accordingly. In hot weather, the receptive bloom period will be short, from three to six days. These conditions will likely require more than one application per day to be applied. Watch the bloom closely. Don't let it get away from you. 
In cool weather conditions, the receptive bloom period will be longer. Beef light will be poor. In general, if the bees are flying, put on pollen. If bees begin flying but are not flying very strong, use half a tablespoon and try to get half of an application applied. If they start flying stronger, put on a second half tablespoon. If the weather breaks for a day and you have strong bee flight, put on as many applications as the bees will take out. Work with every available opportunity to get the pollen on the bees to set your crop. Take advantage of each opportunity until all the applications have been applied. Pollen cannot be applied in the rain or fog. Applications must be made during the dry periods. In order to apply pollen, two to three hours of dry weather are needed and bee flight must be occurring. It may be necessary to apply multiple applications each day during the dry periods. As you can see, bee activity is enhanced when firm and pollen is placed at the hive entrance. Subsequent applications will be made according to weather conditions. In hot weather, less time between applications, and in cooler weather, applications will be further apart. For nearly eight decades, Furman Pollen has been committed to providing high-quality supplemental pollen to our customers that count on us for their pollination needs. Harvesting specific varieties of flowers allows us to supply the correct pollen varieties to fit our customers' needs. Since 1933, we have harvested and refined pollen as our only business. Let our experience serve you. Please contact Furman Pollen at 1-800-322-8852 with questions, blossom thinning requests, and to place pollen orders.